Hi there, my name is Niels Kelsen. I'm the executive chef for Casey's Bar and Grill. And today we're gonna to make our famous back ribs. We've been doing this for a little over 30 years now, a customer favorite. The key to success in these ribs is the marinade that we're making today. It's a secret marinade, but so much for secrets as you can see, because you're gonna be watching me. So here we go. We're gonna start off by mixing all these ingredients. The first one being paprika, black pepper, and a little bit of chopped garlic. Dijon mustard. We got some ancho paste here that you can buy in your grocery store. It's got a little bit of heat to it, but not too much. Salt. Brown sugar. Freshly chopped thyme. Beautiful stuff. Smells outstanding. Worcester sauce. Cinnamon. A little bit of cinnamon. A little bit of olive oil, extra virgin, of course. And then we're going to add some water. And it's been all measured off, and I'll give you a rough idea that it's roughly equal quantity, except for the paprika, that's four to one. Now, I'm going to mix this by hand because it's a lot easier, and I put my gloves on today because it could get a little messy. So you can see it's just a matter of blending all the flavors. It'll be liquidy, but this is a paste that we rub on the ribs, and we let them sit for 24 hours in the fridge. Next, we're going to take our rib here. We're going to put the rub on it. It's approximately two ounces or four tablespoons per rib and obviously you're going to have to put them on both sides. Rub it in, massage it in. These are beautiful fresh pork ribs. These are back ribs of a nice meaty size. We're going to wrap it in tin foil. Lovely. So now it goes into the oven at 325 degrees for approximately an hour and a half. The ribs are out of the oven now, an hour and a half. A little about two minutes on the grill with a nice coating of our double shot barbecue sauce here in Casey's. Both sides, of course. Once we've done that, the ribs are basically ready to go. And the only thing that would make these better is a nice cold beer and some sunshine. Here we go, ready to go. Beautiful ribs, nicely seasoned. And here you have it, Casey's famous back ribs. Best served with a nice cold beer and about a dozen napkins. You can try it at home or go to any one of the 35 cases across Ontario and Quebec. Bon appétit.